a sweltering Waco, Texas evening. It is Baylor and Arkansas. This one is for everything. The winner heads to Omaha. And John Clay Reeves hitting eighth and hitting ninth is Derek Bleeker. On the mound for Baylor, Tyler Brimmer, a senior out of Berkeley, California. Last year, not... Jacob usually hits against right-handers and swings away on the first pitch. To the left side, long run for Evett, can't catch it, one hops, and Logan Vick will get it in. Yesterday, the DH for Arkansas. Got him, inning over. Ficcicello strikes out for the second time in this Super Regional game. Randall Fant, the junior left-hander out of Texarkana, Texas, gets the baseball, 6'4", 185, and there's a look at his scouting report. He's got to get that changeup where he came back and won three out of those five series, so Coach Van Horn hoping they can pull off some of that same magic here. He swings and misses out. That's how good that offense was for Mike Martin. And how good is the pitch? from Brimmer. Two and one on Vincent. That could be a gapper, but Vic chases it down in left center. Nice running grab from the center fielder. The timing of it all is the tough part. Boy, he smoked it right to the counterpart for Arkansas. Tim Carver puts a glove on it. Toth, a 291 hitter, steps in. One homer. Here's another ground ball. See if Biggin can make a play. Nice, strong throw from Bo Biggin. Boy, it's nice for Arkansas to have a couple of seniors up the middle. Check swing. He did go. Strike him out. So one, two, three. First ninth inning comeback of the year. Sharply hit to Langford over the first one down over the top every now and then, but different release points all the time. Really keep these battles at bay. On the diamond in 2012. Vic just sticks the bat out on an 0-2 pitch. So Looney has seen some good pitches. And that one was a little bit low, and it gets past Reeves as he looks at the webbing of the mitt. That'll get Vic over to third. So a couple of pass balls. Muncy pops it up. Will it stay in play? Reeves makes the catch. One down and a huge out. How about Fan? One on Tui. And he's loaded him up. Get a pretty good pitch to hit. Fant answers back with a breaking pitch. And Lankford swings right over the top. And the Bears will leave the bases loaded. Bigham, little blooper behind second. Lankford runs out, makes the play two down. When you go for the complete game, you can ride him out. Another fly ball. This one right into the glove of Dan Evitz. Another one, two, three inning. Off to Sandburn. A sophomore from Kokomo, Indiana. Swings and misses. One. Try and crank every drive. And lose accuracy. Here's Carver backhand. Quick throw over to first. Ficcicello can't come up with the pick, so Ork beats it out. He's had a great career, was a freshman All-American also. Runner goes, Orff will slide under the high throw on ball four, didn't matter anyway. Overall selection to the A's, in a jam now. Goes off speed and walks Josh Looney. Bases are loaded again for the Bears. Bigham with a big time play. And Arkansas out of a jam again. Bo Bigham, the senior, with perhaps the play of the year for the Razorbacks. Nice play at second by Langford, but then throws it away and doesn't get into the dugout. It does, and Carver will end up at second base. Mahan, Miller scoops at the bag, throws a strike. Over to Max Muncy. So, and he walked him.
Brandon Moore, the sophomore from Van Buren, Arkansas. Big boy at 6'3", almost 230 pounds. His 27th appearance on the year. Here you go. Carver trying to make the turn, and he does. They ordered it up, didn't they? Huge control. And with it being the seventh inning, you've got to think this has got to be Arkansas's best chance to get some runs on the board. That's a good start to get Reynolds out. Inning over. Nice ball. That's going to be a base hit for Miller. Leadoff man reaches. So he's going to see a heavy dose of sliders coming off the left shoulder of Trent Daniel. Logan Vick. Popped him up. Shallow center. Vincent says he has it, and he does. So Trent Daniel does the job again. Langford charges, makes the throw, two down. Hopper to Miller. Boy, what a he has got a gun over there at shortstop. A lot of zeros. You got to think, low scoring game should favor the Hogs. I mean, this is a team that won a game in the regional by beating Rice 1 0. Pulls a bat back and hits a high chopper. Muncie trying to stretch it out, can't do it, and the Hogs do it again. Another double play. Two pitch. Off the end of the bat, right back to Daniel. And the Hogs do it again. Pitching there. Brown ball to third. Tough hop. Tui got a bad break. Runner goes and Brimmer hit him. So now Arkansas has first and second and only one down. Popped him up right side. Long run for Toth. In fair territory, makes the catch. And Serrano heads back to second. So now you have two outs. <laughs> Colby Suggs, the powerful right-hander, the sophomore. Look at that record, 6-0 and oh, with a 1.29 ERA, making his 29th appearance of the year. In the bottom of the ninth inning. Reynolds fields, thought about second, but decides to go over to Piccicello at first, so the bunt by Langford is successful. Got him looking. Three pitches, and Turley heads back to the bench. Yeah! To center field. Vincent had him played shallow and played him perfectly. The title last year. That smoke past the third baseman, Cal Tui. Anderson around first. He will hit the brakes and head back. And a leadoff single and a nice at bat for Mr. Anderson. Fouling Anderson over to second. Lays down the butt. It is dynamite. Bigham does his job. Runner in scoring position, one down. We pinch hit earlier, he hits in the ninth spot. Oh, went off speed and got Vincent, two down. So here's Jake Wise. Jake's first at bat tonight. With two down, and Anderson stands at second. Jake, a 243 hitter. That gets underneath the glove. Anderson around third. Here's the throw, not in time, and the Hogs have a one nothing lead in the 10th. Substitution, you've got to wonder if that's Miller in the game, does he get to this ball? You see the range there, Miller's been making play like, plays like that time and time again. At the very least, if you're Dal Porto, you got to try and knock that thing down just to not let that ball go into the outfield. Not able to... Get a glove on it. 
And then comes Brian Anderson around from second to score. And Arkansas. We go to the bottom of the 10th inning. Arkansas three outs away from a trip to Omaha. But first. Yeah. Fly ball right side. Anderson. One down. The Bear fans are hoping he's got some more magic in his bat. Smokes it to center. Matt Vinson broke in and then took a couple of steps back, and that's two down. And, now... and he walked him. With two outs, down a run in the bottom of the tenth. And that'll sneak in for a base hit. Chased it. Throw down to first. Arkansas going to Omaha. before they can get to Omaha. And for the Razorbacks, this is how it's been all year. A gutty, gritty group from Fayetteville finds a way to win.